Hello everyone, it's Jackie. I was just doing a little work on my altered my altered book, so I thought I would um, show you. It's actually early in the morning for me right now, so I shouldn't have any interruptions um, with the littles, because they're not here. They're home asleep in their beds. So I thought I'd show you what I did, and I'm not sure where I was, but I think I put the belly band on this page and I did this page and this page I did a little bit of stuff and I got this really cute little um, fabric cluster from um, Christy with um, the packages from um, Ooh La La Crafts and I did this pocket or, or this tag to go in this pocket and I just, I tried double sewing this time just for the heck of it to see what happens. Left my strings on. Stick that back in there. I like to do these huge tags, especially in a book like this that's, um, that doesn't have a lot of writing space here. I mean, you certainly could journal here very easily, but, you know, that's just some extra space. So now, I actually moved over to here because I had done that double pocket on the triangle um, the other day too and I decided to try something just a little different so I just did a fold here but I also went back and cut um, some of the bulk out of this so when it's down that released a lot of bulk that won't be here um, in the book so it'll make it it won't make it as big. I mean, I don't have that many more pages to do, but you can see it's already starting to to get a little a little full. And, and I haven't put much of them in here, only the uh, a few tags here and there. So, <clears throat> I thought we'd work on this this morning, and I'll show you the paper that I want to use, because I, I love this little paper pad I got. Um, it's just the paper in here. I've shown this to you before. It's just lovely. I mean, yeah, this is one of my favorites right here. Yeah, just really, really like it. So, I'm gonna pick something here to put here, and then I'm sort of hoping I might have enough to go here. Not sure. So, let's, let's just look through here and Pick out something. I'm not sure what I want. I want something a little more than that. Um, that's really cute, and that has the right. It has the right corner part up here. I want to pick something that's going to have an all-over corner effect. And I love that one, but it's not really in the corner. Might have been it. That probably my first pick was it. That one's in the corner. Okay, yeah. But I really like this one. So where was it? Where was it? Right here. Okay. This is what we're gonna do. Pull him out. I have lace, I have things everywhere because I'm trying to decide about my cover on this and it just hasn't come to me yet what I really want to do. So I'm, you know, I did a couple things last night to try it out and I just couldn't decide. So, so I'm not deciding yet. All right, so that we put right here. Is that going to get in? The flower. Let's just see. Stick that in there. Mm -hmm. So it can, it can, because that can come out like there. Yep. And that'll go. 
it'll be that. So that's pretty. That's pretty. Okay. Let me just make sure I'm lined up. And I'm, this is so very technical. I'm going to draw a line right here as to where that needs to be. <clears throat> and I'm going to cut a little wider because I want a little bit to go down under um, the flap. So I'm going to cut with my paper cutter just because, you know, it'll be a little straighter for me. It will be a little straighter. So I'm going to just, I don't even know. Hopefully you can see this. So I'm going to come down a little bit off of that line, a little more even. If I go from corner to corner, where's my line? Now it's right on the line, isn't it? So I want to come down from the line. And I think that should be good. And then I do have a nice corner left. I can do a, a corner pocket or something. we got. Let's see that will go right in here. Like so. And hmm, that's a lot more than I sometimes I'm not very not very good at this. Do I not get in the corner? need to lift up the page to see what you're doing, but, oh yeah, that's fine. That's good. Okay. Yeah, that'll come out like that. And those little roses will just be kind of peeking out to make themselves known right there. All right. Um, that doesn't have to be perfect yet. So I could even do like a tuck over here on this page that will pull that in. Yeah, that could work. Okay, so I've got that piece. Now, uh, let's see. Let just, don't, uh, let's see if I can close pin this a little bit so I can see what I'm doing. And I'll just pin that one. So that's there. I need a little drink of tea. It's very early here. It's like 4.30 in the morning. You know, sometimes I just wake up and I can't go back to sleep, so I get up and actually I woke up and I was thinking about this and what should I do? And that's when I thought of just maybe turning this under. Now this, <clears throat> um, I obviously can't get one of these six by sixes to fit there. And I'm gonna use that over on this side, so. Maybe one of the, and I want a pinker page because there's not a lot of color in the, um, I like this page, but I'm not a cheruby type person. I don't know if that's a cherub. I don't know. Can, can you see that? Um, so I don't really like that page. Yep, yeah, you can see that, right? I like this part of it, but I don't like that up there. So that's going to have to wait for somewhere where I use the other side, which I could use the other side up there. <clears throat> Let's see what else. That rose is on the wrong side. Maybe just a little pink like that. Maybe that could go there. And then I can tuck something down or over the top of this. Let's do that there. I'm still not doing the page I thought I would do, <laughs> but that could go there. So that's kind of nice um, because that's going to pick up this and it could actually, um, I mean, I'll cut it here. 
but it could actually um, go across, you know, right across to there. I'm going to quickly stitch around this, just a quick little stitch here on this one. Before I forget, I, I like stitching, and um, first I'm going to distress it out, actually. Just re-inked my stamp pad. So we'll see. This is the ground espresso. Yes, I have fallen in love with ground espresso. Okay. I don't want to get too crazy, but I do want to get like, in the corner a little more. Okay. And cover back on. Now, this will be a little bit noisy, sorry, but it won't be too much. Won't be too much, and I'm just going to do a little straight stitch around here. It's not that noisy, I guess. I always think it's going to be, but it's really not a noisy machine. There, that looks good. Oh yeah, that looks really nice. I love that. Okay, good, good, good. Now, let's see how are we going to do this one. So we need it to be like there. Whoops, A rose, let's get the rose over here. Okay. So about like that, right? Over to um, there-ish. Okay, let's pull that down a little. Try to straighten that up. Um, yeah, right about there, I think. All right, I'm gonna tear this. a little I want it to look a little ragged Ooh, but not that ragged <laughs> I always forget which way to go on this because you tear it a certain way if you tear it towards you you don't get this um, part and I do not like to have that part so we'll just distress this up right here Hope you are all well wherever you are and whatever time of day it is for you. It's Tuesday for me, but this probably won't air till um, Thursday because I have another one that I need to get uploaded. <clears throat> and I don't know. I cannot get my I can't get my videos to um, to go the right way. It, it, they always end up going um, vertical instead of horizontal when I get done. So I've learned to go into iMovie and I can rotate them. So, and it's quite, it's quite easy. It's not a big deal. So that's something I've learned to do to help out with. Okay, to sew or not to sew? thinking we sew. Okay, I'm going to go all the way around this time so it'll be a wee bit longer. But you can um, fast forward through if you don't want to listen to the machine. And just get right to the edge there. <clears throat> going to 
I'll go the three sides on this and leave this side jagged. I am going to cut my top threads. I don't, I'm leaving a lot of these. Okay. So that's good. Let's see. Get back over here. Mm -hmm. There we go, right there. And that's just going to hang over and make that pocket very nice. Okay. So then I don't think I I don't think I want to continue this. Um, I want something with a little more something. Um, so I'm thinking maybe some music paper here would be nice. Let's see how that would look. Can I go all the way up on that? I can. Yeah. Okay. That that works. That works good. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to glue this on and then I will cut it after. Okay. Sounds like a plan. Um, let's just hang on one second. One second, please. Just wanted to make sure where I was going with this. Okay, so that's going to want all the ink right to there. Okay. That's okay. Good. this done so I can start pulling my bee journal together. I've made a ton of ephemera for that. So the ephemera pieces are pretty much ready to go. There'll be a few more things I want to add, but because I've got my fabric now, so I can do some belly bands with fabric and get the cover going. I mean, the, the cover's made. It's just not decorated. So I wasn't sure exactly what I wanted to do. And I've been looking for ideas and finding something. Whoa, there goes that paper clip. Sometimes it's just easier. Um, you can just go along this, but, um, but I do like that little dark edge that you get from doing this, so, all right. Man, my desk is a mess. But it was time to clean your desk when you want to be, you know, crafting, making stuff, doing stuff. Come on. That's just, I think that's unreasonable to even think of that. up a bit. page. 
Come on now. Everybody got going. Got any summer uh, vacation plans? Are you working on any kind of journals? What you got going? You know? I'd like to know what people are doing. It's just fun. Okay, so yes, we're gonna glue that on. I think I'm gonna take this off because that's not going to show and I know it's very thin but it is a little bulk that we really don't need okay uh, I think that's good right there so let me grab my uh, do I want to use my glue stick or my art glitter glue um, actually I think I'm going to use my glue stick because it's just going to be better. Where's my glue book? I lost my glue book. Oh, right here in front of me. Yikes. I don't know where that was. <coughs> Turned it. Okay, here we go. As soon as I put them a little, uh, a little cheap around the edges, I find. And then I just have to, oh, don't rip. It's very um, thin. This vintage um, music paper is like just very thin and delicate. So I don't know. Sometimes I'm not very. <laughs> Or thin for that matter. <laughs> oh dear. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. Oh, and of course, you know, I did not have to glue on the top part of this because um, maybe I'll just fold that over actually. Right around the edge. That won't add a lot of bulk because it's thin and it will hold that down. So, double, a double glue there, double glue. Okay. That looks nice. Okay, let's, um, <coughs> sorry, excuse me. Let's do this piece. I hope this is gonna glue down okay. I think it will. on this one. Okay, lay down there. And make sure I get this right on the edge. Like so. Yeah, see the glue stick gives you a little bit of time to make sure you're where you want to be. <clears throat> I hope I'm in camera for that. <laughs> I probably wasn't. Sorry. Strings out of there. Get up here. I really, yeah, I want you to stick it out. Pretty. What are you doing right there? There you go. Okay, so that looks very lovely. And then this piece that's going to go here. So I just need a little piece of something right here. Yes. Okay. Um, and I'm going to allow that to just kind of jut over on the top here. But 
but I think I want to put something under here first unless I decide to put a little a little bit of zhuzhi lace or something <clears throat> let's see what's hanging around here I have stuff I have so much stuff let's see doing. What if I do something like this, but that's still going to be okay, but I like that. Just coming down a little bit from there. Um, hmm. What's that string? I don't know. Not sure what that is for. It doesn't need to be there. <clears throat> go down a little bit onto there. So let's see if I just, if I just give this a little bit. I need to go down the side here anyway. Get down in there. Okay. And that'll be fine to see the print behind there. Yeah, I like that. I like that. I think that works out okay. So we want like... Do I want to come all the way up? This is, this is very um, dainty and not stiff, so it's not going to stick up really. But that would be super cute, wouldn't it? How much... How much would we have to have to stick up even just to there? Just a wee bit more. So we'll go right to here, this one. Okay. This is lace from Ula La Crafts. You probably realize that because I showed you. And this is the one that comes in a bunch of colors, a bunch of colors. All right, so I'm gonna do it this way. Things are, things are falling around. Things are not ready to be up this morning. Okay, good. So let's, let's glue this piece on. So I do custom orders. If there's something in particular that you are fond of or you need a little Mother's Day gift or a graduation gift or baby shower gift, um, I can make you journals. And there's really, there's, uh, there are digitals, you know, out there for like, Pretty much anything that you can think of. Pretty much anything. So, you know, I can, I can pretty much whip up anything. Mother's Day is just, you know, a couple weeks away, so. Graduations and all that. I don't know if that's going to stick very well. Not. Let's put a little bit of glitter glue just down the edge of this. I don't know if I didn't get the glue all the way to the edge there. I'm not sure. But that will help it just to stay down. Okay. Here we go. Sometimes, 
sometimes can't get that in. Okay, so here's our lace. And I was thinking I'm gonna just cut off this this little piece right here. And I might cut a little more, but there. Thoughts of are pretty, isn't it? Yeah, and that gives that will still, um, this still, this is a huge pocket here. I'm going to have to glue this down. Um, that's a huge pocket, so <clears throat> plenty of room to get that. For a tag to go in there. Just thinking about what kind of a tag that I want. <clears throat> because if I glue that, that's going to be glued down. But that's, I think that's okay. <laughs> Do I want to leave this open for a little tag to go in there or for a, a long tag? I might. Okay, I think I'm going to do that. I'm going to leave this open. I'm going to glue these, this down, but I'm going to leave this open. Let's put a little, um, a little, uh, little uh, semicircle here, so it won't be known that it is a a little tag space there. Okay. And those are the strings show. Oh, I bet it's, I bet it's glued in. There we go. Got it. <laughs> okay. All right, let's get this glued down and then we'll see what we've got. So first things first, just a little bead of glue right along there. I'm actually... I need to do a bead of glue in here too. A little more than a bead. Just so that gets um, this page really has a little bit of an anchor to it there. Okay. And then this page also. Cut that little piece. It just any little part that you can cut gets rid of some of the bulk, and that's that's good. doesn't have a front and a back, I guess. I'm going to stick that little guy right there. Um, yeah, okay. Okay, let's, let's just This is what this glitter glue is super. I think I see, I see what I'm doing here. Because you just can get such a little tiny part. This is a little fiddly, I'm sorry, but um, 
that's just it. Okay, now that was, see, here I go, being silly. I don't want to glue that part up there because that's the part that's hanging off, right? Yeah, let's not get too crazy. And I probably, um, I'm only going to put a dot here in the middle. This should be good enough. Okay, let's see what we got. Now this is, the glue is, um, Kind of you stick it down it's where it is so you gotta make sure you get it where you want it to be Let's see if we can get it fairly straight yeah that's what i was thinking before i do need to glue that a little bit down on the top right there just to help it the lace not to do all the work holding that down. And maybe right up in here too. There we go. Just a little bit in there. And I'm just going to hold that down a little. Make everybody happy here. Yes, yes. Okay. So I think I'm going to stop here. And do, I'll probably work a little bit more, but I will show you. I'm going to make tags, and so I'll, I'll be coming back to show you what I'm going to do. I'm, I'll come back and show you what I have done. And so I will see you again soon. Have a lovely, lovely day. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.